hi my lovely gemini welcome to my channel my name is natasha goddess of life 1111 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely lovely gemini sun moon rising venus and jupiter my reading are timeless you see it when you met to see it thank you god thank you universe universal energy my sister my spirit guy the pure white light i can draw michael i said masters please give my lovely beautiful gemini a clear precise honest message thank you thank you oh you could be dealing with the sagittarius also this is a general love reading it won't resonate with everyone if this reading is not resonate with you please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity take what resonate and leave the rest energy are fluids if this reading is not for you is not for you but thank you for all your like your support your love your subscribe i appreciate you guys and i'm sending lots of love light peace your way thank you so much and don't forget to subscribe my beautiful gemini i love you guys oh you had the will of fortune yeah the universe asking you not to worry that's what i'm feeling here uh not to worry go with the flow let's think flow naturally yes you're gonna have a brand new beginning here my gemini this is you and the universe asking you to just no no stress go with the flow <laughs> oh my god look at that you coming out in here as the sun <clears throat> your first card is the sun this is true blissful happiness yes <coughs> excuse me my gemini i don't know what happened but the sister is here about to get her some water excuse me yeah oh my goodness i'm so sorry <clears throat> the first cards you have is the sun beautiful you coming out with shine you coming out the, you know you feel like a child again you got freedom going on that's what it say at the bottom yeah to go with the flow because change this is for you being you know you change for the better you have brand new things clarity you know exuberant transformation all of that good stuff come in wow look at that you could be very happy for some of you um you could be moving but we have the chariot here so there could be you making major move right here but you are extremely extremely happy about the decision you are making in your lives right now yeah and rest and we consider like i say you could be dealing with sagittarius you see what come out Rest and we consider whomever this uh, Sagittarius is, they are thinking about you, they're missing you. Someone is coming towards you also. I'm letting you know. They are coming towards you. So they could be exhausting, they could be uh, traveling, they could be traveling doing the airways, but someone is coming towards you. <clears throat> yep. And they are waiting. For some of you, it's a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or Sagittarius that's coming, that's coming and say hello to you. Mm -hmm. But whatever this move, if you are moving toward this person, um, or moving, making um, this major moves here, it's making you you're gonna be extremely ecstatic, ecstatic, extremely happy about this move you are making because <clears throat> there's this person is waiting so they could be waiting on their flight they could be waiting on the bus but someone is waiting in here for something oh honeymoon yes like i say you guys could be just getting to know each other moving in together just just like excitement i'm sorry <laughs> i'm so excited for you yes i'm telling you you guys are going to move in with someone gemini whomever this person is whether you're moving toward each other moving together moving to higher commitment you guys are very happy 
uh, because there was chemistry between you guys. Okay. You deserve love. Yes, you are. You sure is. And free yourself. So you could be dealing with someone else at the moment. Or you could be thinking because, you know, free yourself doesn't mean that, you know, you are with someone. It could be like, you know, because you can see this uh, little, um, <clears throat> oh my God, this little horse here is like in a circle, you know, they can free themselves, but they stay in that, you know, in that thing, like they are unable to move. So you can free yourself. It could be some mental thought process. So you can, whenever you deserve, you could be uh, with someone that who does not treat you the way they're supposed to treat you. They not respect you. They not love you the way you're supposed to love. And then here you are gonna be with my little, you know, beautiful Gemini, you know, and that's when everything changed. You know, you guys are happy. I'm looking forward to see that too, Gemini. Mm-hmm. Don't worry, I was gonna say something nice when I say little, but I just I realized that we are Mercury retrograde. You know, a lot of time a lot of time, you know, we say things and people take it very seriously and too negative, so I don't say anything, but it was gonna be something beautiful that's why i said the beautiful after that <laughs> <clears throat> the unicorn it's time this i was gonna say this beautiful unicorn here but i'm like leave it alone <sighs> spirits is say it natasha say it <laughs> seven of, F of inspiration yeah there was someone here someone need to release someone could be black someone here they could be resisting some type of change you know that's what awaken yeah there's communication who's gonna come in uh with to you with whomever you are dealing with gemini and you know spirit asking you just go with the flow yeah there's no need to make queen of material you could have um You could have Taurus Virgo Capricorn in your chart, but I feel like my lovely Gemini, you are ready to, you know, you are ready for commitment. Yeah, Queen of Materials here with the Six of Materials. This is you ready for giving and receiving. You could dealing with a um, Virgo. Yeah, this is justice. Yes, 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 yes. Mm. Oh, here you are, the lovers. Oh, so this is your, this is your chance. So you could be needed to free whomever you are dealing with because there was a Taurus Virgo Capricorn that wants giving and receiving with you. And you know, this is your justice. This person is supposed to give you justice by doing giving and receiving, giving you a full commitment here. Sagittarius, the temperance. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius, like I said before, or you could have Sag on your chart heavily. But I feel like you are heartbroken here. Why are you heartbroken? Or you could be getting some ascend. You could be ascending here. What's the three of voice? Oh yeah, <clears throat> definitely. You could have Sagittarius in your chart or dealing with a Sagittarius here. Clarify the temperance. There's some healings. You need to do some healings. Balancing be at peace. Wow, look at that. The emperor. Okay. You are stable, grounded, very structures. So you are focusing, you know, letting go. Focus on your family. Focus, your, focus on your stability here. Yeah, that's what you are doing. You're looking at things in different perspective. Love it, love it. Clarify the lovers for my Gemini. You coming in with readings. Ooh, a lover. Knight of Cups. Lover, lover. You are, you're getting a love offer coming towards you. It's going to come in slow, but they are coming. 
clarify the knight of cups for my gemini please beautiful gemini yes communication so this person is coming towards you they're gonna offer you that stability you wanted because we know that the emperor you know a lot of time you know emperor could be a father their business owner they also represent you know a higher up you know someone that's in the public eye also so whomever this person is coming to you they are big deal they could be um, judge, lawyer, they're working, uh, someone could be working in the justice system, but they come in and give you, to give you justice. Yes, they are. Clarify the eight of wands for my Gemini. Wow, okay then. Yeah, I'm telling you, someone is ready. Someone is definitely ready for commitment here. Definitely ready for commitment. It could be a Taurus, uh, Virgo or Capricorn. Clarify the justice card. <laughs> three of swords yeah because this person this person hurt you before so they want to come in to um make amends they're coming back to make him in the moon but you don't know about that this person is hiding this as a secret yep matter of fact they hide this as a secret in man they are manipulate they are manipulated because they are hiding their emotions they are hiding what they try to do, but that person, want, they want a commitment with you. Mm -hmm. But they are hiding it. The magician with the moon here, I feel like someone is, you know, uh, emotionally manipulative here. But they want a commitment with you. Queen of Materials, please, for this person Gemini is dealing with. Someone that is holding to you, Four of Pentacles. They could be holding to, you know, their money. Someone is, doesn't want to spend their money here. That's what I'm feeling. Yeah. They release, you know, they're not trapped. They're not mentally trapped anymore. They're not, you know, this person is, is start seeing things for what it is. Oh, two of swords. Look, <laughs> they, they can't blind, they're blindfolded. They know they need to make a decision. Clarify the six of materials oh boy the tower Whew. yeah i feel like there's some i feel like there's some my game going on here i can telling you this i feel like someone is playing my game i feel like you know because of that the universe is like someone who said that okay i'm gonna offer you stability here but there's a but you know, I see things the way it is, you know, but they're going to hold on to the money, you know, and then and then they're tr going to try to make a this decision like they are confused. This person is going to act like they are confused. And then when it's come to the giving and receiving, the universe is going to bring the tower. If the person is coming into your life and not doing things, not doing it, they're going to bring the tower for some of you. Why is the tower here for this person? Yeah. There's going to be a delay coming towards you and they're going to have the tower because if they're not doing things they're supposed to be doing, that's what they're asking you to go with the flow here. Don't be so quick to go give this person a commitment because there's going to be an ending. The wall, the wall in the death card, definitely. Oh my God, we have ending. This is going to be a disastrous. Y'all know why? Because we have the... um the tower we have the tower upright the wall in the reverse in the death card in the reverse i mean upright so uh, three endings three endings so which means that this person tried to avoid a tower no they're not trying to avoid they try to avoid the wall which is the end and then there's the death card like like hold on partner mm -mm. there's gonna be ending because you're not doing the, the right thing whether it's emotion because this person is playing the confusion games here that's what i'm feeling for you gemini they are playing like they are confused they're playing this and then there's the ending so they can transform the situation again if you give this person a chance that's what's going to happen six of swords and then healings see this uh sagittarius six of swords that's what i say you got you could be dealing with the sagittarius you know oh look at that 
once you get to, once they get through that healing after this tower they're gonna offer an ace of cups but the ace of cups come with what the unknown this person is almost seem like they're still confused when it's come to what they try to offer they're not they're still confused when it's come to that it's fall like this we're gonna leave it like this let me see to why this person is unsure when it's come to the um Ace of Cups. Clarify the unknown, please. The Wheel of Fortune. This person knows this is faded. It's supposed to be happen. Gemini, this person, whomever you are dealing with, like I said, could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, a Sagittarius. They know this is faded to happen this is a faded even or you can be dealing with the scorpio they know this my game this whatever confusion they have to stop then is the change is coming this is a faded even this is destiny they uh they have to go through that regardless in order for them to learn a lesson because we have the wheel of fortune here twice so this person the universe is gonna push them to do the right thing no matter what because they have the towel the wall and the death card in the same wall so whether they like it or not they have the ending will have to happen this person have to go to you know the process the process of healings after all this ending but the confusion what they try to do that oh i'm not sure here oh i'm not sure here you understand what i'm saying when it's come to the giving and receiving, they promise, they over promise, under delivered. That's what I'm feeling here. Someone say, I'm going to do the right thing. And then once you start, you know, once you give them a second chance, and then they're going to change back to their old self and being manipulative and things like that. And this is when the universe is going to decide it. It doesn't work that way. Yeah, because you have the star wishing upon the star with the Knight of Cups in the star. Look at that. Wishing, wishing upon the star. This is about healings. You know, the Knight of Cups this is about making a wish again. Wish fulfillment, being happy, blissfully happy, being in love. But this person, whomever you are dealing with, they are playing some type of game. And they think this is a game. But the universe is going to show them difference, though. So, oh, good luck. Whomever you are dealing with. Toys, Virgo, Capricorn. They say they want to get married, but they're confused. They don't know what they want. Joy and contentment. Yeah, someone sees you as stable. They see you as the empress. They see you being, they see you very happy. And the universe is asking you to continue to be that way. Ooh, look at that clear cancel and release so yeah you have you raise your vibration early gemini so they what they try to say intuition and downloads yeah use your intuition when it's come to this person that's what the universe is telling you use your intuition when it's on forgiveness and understanding you know because someone in here is manipulative they confuse you know despise that you want to have a family with this person. You want to have, be in a relationship. You are stable and grounded, but this person is just playing some type like some type of my game. And you guys could be uh, so much of uh, soulmate connection in here, very spiritual connection. That's you know gonna kick your butt behind. That's what I'm trying to say. You can be in a soulmate connection that's kicking your behind because. There's a lot of, you know, the uh, wheel of fortune here. It's like destiny is calling this person to change. But at the same time, they continue doing this thing. The justice is for this person to show you to be in a commitment relationship with you, to marry you, all of that. But they're not seeing that way. So since you raise your vibration, the universe is continuing to asking you to black this person, you know, set up a uh, healthy boundary for yourself when it's come to whomever this person the universe is asking you to do that right now so i love you my be beautiful gemini that's all i have for you guys please like subscribe share and comment bye gemini